you, Speaker. And I'd also like to welcome all of our distinguished guests here in the Legislature today. It's an honour to speak about Pride Month as the Ontario NDP critic for LGBTQ issues. New Democrats are proud to stand in solidarity with the LGBTQ community, not just in June, but every day of the year. Pride Month is an important opportunity for us to celebrate the gains we've made and reflect how, on how far our society still needs to go. Last July, I had the privilege of marching in London's Pride Parade for the first time as an openly gay MPP. The level of support and enthusiasm was incredible, and it was inspiring to see members of London's LGBTQ community march proudly while being cheered on by supportive families and neighbours. I look forward to attending more Pride events this month, such as Blockorama, organized by Nick Redmond, as well as many others throughout the summer. Organizations like Pride Toronto have worked day and night to host a wide range of parades, art shows, speakers, and festivities in the village and across Toronto. Pride events like these are happening all across our province, from Sarnia to Peterborough to Ottawa, and I encourage my colleagues across the aisle to attend these events. I hope they celebrate alongside the LGBTQ community while also listening to their concerns. I want to thank the many LGBTQ organizations, activists, and volunteers that are working tirelessly to show their communities that love is love. But it's also important to remember that Pride was founded as a protest. Pride began as a way to recognize the Stonewall Riots when Marsha P. Johnson and so many others stood up for equal rights. We continue to stand on their shoulders and the shoulders of those who came before us. We must honor their legacy by remembering that Pride remains a time for the LGBTQ community to push for equal rights. And on this account, we have still much distance to go. Wait times for gender reassignment surgeries across the province remain lengthy and costly. Inclusive programs and curricula that represent LGBTQ students in schools are under threat, whether it is conservative governments, repealing modern sex ed programs, or attacking gay straight alliances in high schools. It's important to remember our federal and provincial governments that pride is more than a symbol, and the LGBTQ community needs more than symbolic gestures to achieve true equality in our society. A commemorative coin, a token, means very little when we don't see legislative change. Thank you.